bota, te pinta de tu mano, tu quieras bota, estás loca, te pide todo lo que tú quieras. Que nadie te diga, baby, hazlo a tu manera. Que seguro y pesa lo que pesa en mi cartera. Everyone say hi. hi. <laughs> Jocelyn, hi. what's up? What are we doing today? We're skydiving. We're jumping off an airplane, huh? What brought on that bit of insanity? My cousin's birthday. Ah, oh, which one is that? The one in the green. Everybody wave. Yes, I hate everything. <laughs> no, it's fine. <laughs> You're gonna have fun. Thank you. So did all the paperwork ready? I did all the training ready to do this? Yep, I'm ready. What do you want to say to friends and family who may not be here today? I love them. Hey. I'm excited. Well, remember when you're up there, keep your head up and smile. Okay, will do. <laughs> Have an airplane. That was crazy. How much fun was that? that was so Call them over fun. here, quick. Hey! So what was the best part? Free fall. Free fall. Yeah. <laughs> How's our guy over here? Luis, should we keep him? Yeah, <laughs> okay. Great. Well listen, congratulations on your first skydive. Thank you. Who's coming in right now? Angie, Angie, Angie I'll film right here. <laughs> <laughs> All right, ladies, thumbs up, thumbs up. Hi, everyone. It's Josie. Welcome back to my channel. If you are a returning subscriber and if you are brand new, welcome to my channel. All right, so what I have for us today is my very first stuffing of the month of December. All right, so this is actually what I brought to the teller, and this is the amount we will be stuffing today. Uh, this isn't like my biggest stuffing, but I did get paid a little bit less just because I took some time off for the holidays. 
Um, so I just have to make do with what I have. Uh, so this stuffing won't be as big as my other ones. Okay, so let's just make sure that we have the proper um, denominations here. All right, so I have 100. I have 250s, perfect. I have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 140 in 20s. Okay, I have $20 in, in 10s. So two tens here, five, 10, 15, 20, $20 in fives. Perfect, so that seems to be matching up. So let's get on to our stuffing. So I do like to start off with my cash envelopes first. So that is what we will be doing. So I'll, re I'll be removing uh, my sinking funds just so we can have a little bit more room. Okay, so car insurance will be getting $95. So this is a non-negotiable because I'm always gonna have this payment and no matter like how big or small my paycheck is, this will always be the same and it needs to be paid. So let's get a 50, two 20s and a five. So here we have 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95. So again, I like to split this payment um, between my two paychecks uh, because this uh, my car insurance payment isn't due to the end of the month anyway. So instead of me taking out 195 from just one paycheck, which is a big ding, I just like to split it. So I do 95 from each paycheck. So car insurance is set. Food, I will not be stuffing food just because I had mentioned that my paycheck is smaller. So uh, I do have to cut back in some areas and one of that is eating out. So I will not be stuffing food. Fun, uh, usually I do put $60 in here. This is more for like my date nights or like any other um, fun activities I have planned. Um, but again, my paycheck wasn't as big. So instead of it $60, I'll be putting $40, which is still enough. You know, you can do, you could still do a lot of fun stuff with just $40. So $40 in fun. My paychecks will be going back to normal soon though. Um, it's just with the holidays and stuff and spending time with family, you know, I rather do that. Perfect. So $40 in fun. So next is Jim. Jim will not be getting stuff. Again, my paycheck was small, so no room for Jim. Um, groceries, same thing, not getting stuff. Beauty, I have already gotten my nails done. Um, so that is good for me. I will be set until next paycheck, so not getting stuffed. Gas will be getting stuff though. So gas will be getting $60, so I'll get a 50 and a 10, again, another non-negotiable. Like I can make do without getting my nails done or I can make do without getting new supplements for the gym. Um, it's just these other things like car insurance, going out a little bit here and there and my gas, that is something that I prioritize more than the other categories, which is why these three got stuffed and not the others, okay? We're done with our cash envelope, so we're gonna be moving on to my high priority binder, which is my purple one. Um, so let's see what we have here. So first, we're gonna start off with car maintenance. So car maintenance, I do usually put $15, but um, you see my alternator is broken and I also need to pay for my car registration. So instead, I'm gonna, instead of the usual 15, I'm gonna be putting $35 in here. A key takeaway I learned this year, because this is my very first um, year stuffing. So what I learned this year is that I need to bump up my car maintenance envelope. Um, just because, you know, you wake up one day, your car is fine. You wake up the next day, you owe like $400, which is insane. But you just have to plan for that and then you'll be offset. So in my cart maintenance envelope as of right now, I have 100, 120, 140, 150, sorry, that was out of order, 155, 160. So $160 in cart maintenance. Yep. So make sure you always have a nice little cushion in your cart maintenance envelope. 
um, because you never know what's going to happen to your car. And really, you do need your car. Like, I need my car to get to work. I need my car to, like, go out with friends, you know? Having a car is a privilege, but it is a, it is a very expensive one. All right, Christmas. So, I already purchased all my Christmas gifts. And some tips I have for Christmas is, you know, you have your money set. So, just kind of have, like, an idea of what you want to get your people for Christmas. And maybe set, like, a set budget. So, like, for my sister, I set a budget of $50. For my mom, like, $75. So on and so on. Um, But what really, really helped me was that I kind of got my dad's present for, like, free uh, using my fetch points so i redeemed all my fetch points and i got two uh twenty dollar gift cards from amazon which was great so that really like saved me more room where i can splurge on other gifts you know so christmas will not be getting stuffed we're all taken care of my gifts are under the tree i don't have to worry about it anymore but again you can still use your fetch rewards don't forget especially during the holidays gifts will not be getting stuffed um you know, I don't know how many times I'm going to say this, but smaller paycheck, so got to cut back a little bit. Uh, savings will not be getting skipped, though. I will be putting its usual $100 bill. Um, again, I like to prioritize my savings because you never know what is going to happen. So in my savings, I have 1000 in the bank. So this is my little 1K slip, 1150 So $1,150 is what I have in savings. Perfect. And the next is nose job. So nose job will actually not be getting stuff because it is a smaller paycheck. Um, and honestly, I've just been thinking like of putting a halt to this for right now, very briefly, just so I can like regroup and think. Um, because honestly, I just haven't been as insecure as I used to be when I was younger. Um, I'm 18 and in high school, like my nose really, really bothered me. I didn't like it. But like, I just, I feel like I'm growing into myself and I don't really care as much of what other people think about me. And I've been finding confidence in other ways. Like I've been working out and as I transform my body and stuff, I just realized that like, you know, you're always going to be insecure about something. Um, but still, I will still consider this maybe later on in the future. Um, but we shall see. Next is travel. Travel not be getting stuffed. I usually stuff this with my second paycheck anyway, um, so maybe I'll get stuff next paycheck. All right, so next we're going to move on to my pink binder. So let's see. College miscellaneous will not be getting stuffed. Blessings will not be getting stuffed, unfortunately. But I am planning to do uh, something with this money, uh, especially that we're um, approaching the holidays. So that'll be fun. Uh, YouTube will be getting stuffed, so this is going towards my giveaway. So I'm going to put its usual $5. So in YouTube, I have 20, 25, 30, 31, 32, 33. Ooh, I think that's enough for some cash envelopes. Very exciting. I have to, like, figure out all the kinks into, like, how I'm going to do a giveaway. Um, but very soon, guys. So just keep on watching my videos and you'll see once I'm or when I'm do, doing my giveaway next is dream house dream house will not be getting stuffed but I will not be skipping investments so investments will be getting $45 yeah I just started investing and honestly I love it so much I just feel like I'm I'm setting myself up for success I know there's a lot of risk when it comes to investing but I just feel like you know, saving can only get you so far. Sometimes you just have to take that plunge and really just try to set yourself up for success. And I am doing that by investing. So, perfect. All right, so we stuffed my sinking fund binders, both of them, as well as my cash envelopes. Um, again, this wasn't a very big stuffing, but I just want you to see that, like, you know, you're going to have big checks, small checks, but you just got to make do with what you have. And you just always want to budget it. Even though you have a smaller paycheck, it's so important to know where your money is going, where you're spending it, um, making sure that you're saving, investing with what you have. Like, I just want to show everyone that if you're making minimum wage, not working many hours, you can still set yourself up for success because to not plan is to not plan for success. And we don't want that. So we're all set. I will see you guys in my next video. Have a good one. Keep the fire.
Que nadie te diga, baby, hazlo a tu manera. Que seguro y pesa lo que pesa en mi cartera. Y te 